Hello everyone and welcome back to some more Dead in Bermuda. My name is Babby and I think it was about time to move to the full version. So I played until day 5 since uh, the game save doesn't carry over. Um, I couldn't find a way to do it manually either, but I think it's just fine. Uh, like I said, I played until day, day 5 but we've still got some things to do. It's pretty much the same from what it was uh, when I played with you guys. Let's see, we found an abandoned raft. What I did last time in my private game, I think I surfed on it, and then it went away. Uh, tried to escape the island. Doesn't really work. Try to explore the shore. Let's do that. Um, let's see, we need some relevant data. Fighting and stealth. Well, that seems to be good. Let's try Julia. You jump onto the raft and try to sail near the shore. You quickly find a small creek that you feel oddly attracted to. You decide to stop there. You don't believe your eyes when you see that a very beautiful blue woman seems to be sh <laughs> shaving, having a picnic on the beach. Without a word, she shares a bit of her delicious looking f food. After that, your mind becomes fuzzy and you can't remember how, but you are back where you found the raft. Alright, did something uh, about our hunger and our fatigue. That's uh, pretty good. That's pretty good. Uh, that means that we can get uh, Julia to do something else. Let's see. We need you to go exploring because you suck at basically everything within the camp. Uh, aside from that, for the most part. Now, I want to craft something. But much like our uh, game together, there uh, we, we lack some resources. So we're going to go for some rope. We're going to take a look at who is good at scavenging. Uh, obviously, Yuri is, because, um, you know, he's been scavenging planes, um, the, the plane, not planes. He's been scavenging the plane, and he's been, he, he well, I, I've been giving him items to improve his scavenging. So, obviously, Yuri, uh, but I would say Alejandro as well. Um, yeah, you, we, we can assign two characters, so I don't think that, that will be too bad. I can't recall if I did... No, I did not scavenge already, but that's fine. We've got two phases, and this is going to be the first. Uh, let's see, we want to focus on, I think, wood. Because we got we got six rows, we need two more, but we need 13 more wood. Uh, and we also need it for, uh, for you know, for, for keeping the fire, uh, <laughs> the fire on. And Winters, what can you do? I think you should probably go exploring. Although her fatigue is quite high, we should probably, uh, well, give her a rest. And as of you, Bob, uh, you ought to do something as well, but I can't really... You know, rest, rest a bit more, that is absolutely fine. Jacob is, is a bit tired as well, let's let's ha have him take a nap as well. Let's end our phase right here. We increase our research, but we gain some fatigue, that's fine. I want to keep clicking though. Their relationship is boosted. That is good. Their relationship should be good as is. So th that further increases efficiency, of course. And we've discovered a new area. Let's see what we can get from said area. I think we, we have about enough... No, we don't have enough wood yet. So what we're going to do is... No, no, no. You know what? We're going to focus on rope. We're going to send Yuri to scavenge the plane. Uh, first, we're going to take a look at what this is, actually. It's a shipwreck. Hmm, dive and, dive and search. Let's have Julia do that, actually. I don't want to exhaust um, Yuri too much. He's kind of our muscles, and uh, he does the most valuable stuff. You dive inside the ship and search for something useful. It takes a long while, and many tries. You get hurt by a nasty hackfishes. By a... By a nasty hackfishes. Alright. We gained quite some fatigue. We did level up. We gained scavenging, and we got some rum bottles. Not too good, I'd say, because rum bottles, you'll see in a bit, they, they're they not that desirable. They can be a good item, but they can be bad as well. You dive inside the ship and start scavenging ropes and wood. It takes a long while, and many times you get hurt by nasty hackfishes, even more hackfishes. You know what? Uh, Julia probably deserves a rest. Two wood, two rope. Alright, in that case... You don't need to go for uh, rope, because we got enough of that. You need to take a rest, though. I guess Winters could go exploring. And you, I'm going to level you up. 
What I'm going to do is I'm going to give her a constitution because that increases the amount of fatigue decreased by sleep. Let's see. I think it does more as well. Yeah, it helps for exploration as well, and I assign her for exploration uh, oftentimes. So I think that wouldn't be too bad. Let's see. Jacob, are you done resting? I get the impression you you are. You could probably use some more rest. That's fine. I'll have Il Iliana um, next turn. Or at least next day. There we go. Slight progress. And we'll probably be able to um, to craft the... Um, what was the other item? I think it was fruit baskets. We can get f uh, fruit to maintain our water supply. That wouldn't be too shabby, now would it? You were a medic back then? A surgeon? Cool. And there's me. We thought the surgeons were all old and cranky fellows, eh? Because a woman can't be part of your little male private club. Huh, wh what? No, no, that's not what I meant. That's what you said, though. And that's what every alpha male I met during my whole life said. Wow, what a bitch. Wow, so someone can't be genuinely, genuinely interested, I guess. As a spokesperson for our male private club, I offer you my most sincere apologies. Sorry. Funny. Good night. Wow. And then her opinion of Alejandro decreases. That That is hypocritical. I don't understand that. He was genuinely interested. He was just asking. He was actually quite polite. He was not insinuating anything. Give the, give the guy a break, please. Will ya? Right, next time you guys get along. All right. So, there it is, day six, and what are we going to do right now? I'm going to, uh, I want to say lay Yuri to rest. No, I'm going to, um, let him rest. That seems like a way better plan. Mm, you can go back researching. I think Ulyana deserves, deserves some rests. There we go. Uh, Bob can start crafting, because we probably do have enough, uh, recipes. Yes, there we go. We got 18 wood, 8 rope, and 1 basket. Basket is a thing I found. Uh, I think I'm, I'm pretty sure you can't craft that uh, anyway, so that's that's generally the way you want to get that. <laughs> Probably the only way. Alright, let's uh, increase your exploration skill. Maybe we want to increase that, her, her constitution next time, so that she'll, she'll be able to maintain for longer. But we did discover a new area. Oh, we've got the Lianas. Um, let's see. We could li hunt little monkeys. I think we're going to search. That seems like a good idea to me. We're going to send Julia out. She's sleeping anyway. She's taking a nap. And we get attacked by a two-headed bunny. Funny. All right. We're getting one stealth. You search the area. You find a banana. Yeah, I do remember this. Shouldn't have done that option. My god. All right. Let's send Yuri out to uh, cut the Lianas. And we get attacked by yet another two-headed bunny. Or rabbit. I don't know if you can really tell the difference. I've got four ropes. I guess that's decent. Um, let's see. What do we want to focus on? Probably want to have no particular focus. Because I, I pretty much want all these resources. We don't have any stone. And I get the feeling that we're going to need that in the near future. Although it seems quite obvious to me, let, let's put it that way. Um, no, you're good, you're good, you're good as well. Yeah, everyone's doing that proper job. At least the stuff I wanted to assign them to. I, I, would, I wouldn't call taking a nap uh, a job, but sure. Ah, let's see, we, we can now construct a fishing rod. Ah, that, that'll come in, uh, well, very useful actually. Um... Well, maybe not so much, actually. We probably want to have a cooking place first. Because you probably don't like eating raw fish too much. I guess sushi is okay, but in this game, uh, it's a no-go. I'm sorry. I'm pretty sure that's the next research up the tree, but I don't know. I, I can't recall. Let's dig up. Uh, no, we want to have Julia doing that. I don't know how fighting and stealth is relevant, but that is fine. Let's have her dig up the treasures. She can do stuff as well. You dig a hole with your bare hands for a while when you reach a small wooden box. 
You open it hastily, expecting jewels, but you found something even more valuable. A full set of beautiful dried sausage. Perfectly preserved. Alright, well, I'm, I'm happy to find that. I like myself some meat. Uh, thing is, we haven't we haven't found too much food um, last uh, scavenge run in the airplane, so we might actually be able to find some more food this time. But if we don't, we still have got dried uh, meat, so it wouldn't be the world's biggest problem. You can go out and explore. Um, hmm. Alice, she doesn't deserve a rest. There we go. Three wood, two rope, two meal, and four barely edible meals. Right, it seems like that um, dried meat is going to come in handy. I'm afraid, actually, because I, I honestly didn't want to use it. It makes me wonder, though, like, if, in the airplane itself, can food actually... Um, I want to say deteriorate, but that's not what it's called. Um, wow, lost the word for that. Doesn't matter. Can it... Can it um, become bad. Uh, I do wonder, because in the beginning you find a lot of uh, awesome meals. Later on you find uh, not so many good stuff. Yes, Alice, no problem. You are a brave little girl facing all that's coming. But I wanted to tell you, you are not alone. I'll help whoever, however I can. I'm not alone, miss. My dad is here. And Julia, I guess. She doesn't really like Julia, it seems. Poor thing, of course. I don't want to separate you from your father. But you know, if ever he is angry at you and you're afraid, you can tell me. I'll be there to protect you. You're not her mother. My dad? Angry? Ha! You don't know him. I don't need protection, miss. Not from my dad, at least. You're so innocent, my dear. That's sweet. It's harm war heart warming. Jesus. But you never know with these times. I don't know what you are implying, but it's starting to annoy me. Yeah, I'd be annoyed as well. Good night, miss. How how is her opinion of Ilyana increasing? All right, let's let's just disregard that for a, for a second, and let's uh, feed these people. They deserve it. Uh, not not everyone equally, but uh, uh. right. You need a good meal because you're very important. Bob as well because we need crafting stuff. Now I really can't give him fish because that will that will just spread uh, sickness. So we'll um, we'll hand out the beef jerkies. Uh, we can we can make fish jerkies later on as well. I think. There we go. Actually, I I lie. I, I know that. All right, there we go. The fire um, quality is deteriorating. So let's uh, increase that uh, the the wood supply. Let's see, you could go scavenging, but you could, go, go, you could go crafting as well. My god. Talking is sometimes not my strongest point. Uh, let's have you explore again, because you're pretty good at it. I want to have Alejandro have a little rest. And we're crafting that. Uh, yeah, we're, we're still crafting that. And after that, we're going to uh, craft the um, fisher rod, fishing rod. I think after that, you have the hunting place, but I'm not quite sure. Oh, leveled up. That is convenient. Oh, that's the harvesting basket. After that, we'll be all, we will be able the fishing rod. And after that, we'll see whatever research will bring us. It, it almost makes me feel like uh, we shouldn't even put so much effort in research. Initially, at least. Plus one exploration. Oh, that's, that's convenient. Oh, we got another level up. That's, that's good as well. Right, let's see. We we uncovered two uh, territories. Let's search. Search. Uh, Yuri. Now, what I want to do first uh, with Yuri is I want to get rid of some depression and fatigue because um, that that does um, it it does make the effects less desirable, uh, so to speak. Let's see. He's pretty much depressed, so we'll get we'll give him some chocolate. We'll give him some coffee as well. Coffee is the very essence of life um, I've experienced myself. Let's see. Now, the thing about the rum bottle is you can gain or lose stats, so it's it's quite risky to use, especially when you're near death. Believe me, I tried it. It it's, uh, almost didn't work out well. Let's see, we don't really need um, painkillers. Now, we can't really do much about fatigue. We could give him another cup of coffee at the very least. 
We'll go and all right. Try to make friends. No, we'll hunt it down because we're bastards like that. You know what? Let's uh, have it uh, around. I don't care. But we'll hunt it later on once we'll be able to cook meats or mules. Actually, decorate with seashells. Why would I do that? We're going to search that thing. We're going to send out Yuri. And he filled. He's going to be attacked by a motorized crab. That's curious. You completely destroy the beautiful sand castle while searching around. You found something, but are a bit ashamed that you may have destroyed a child's creation. My God, Yuri, what has what has become of you? What has come of you? All right, we'll send you out scavenging. I guess it wouldn't do too much uh, good for your depression, but we got rid of that by chocolate for the most part. We'll give him another box of chocolates. Oh my God, I've been looking at the wrong stat. My God. Wasted a box of chocolate where I didn't want to do that. Right, at least we've got some miracle potions and some healing water. Let's see, we want to improve your crafting skills. There we go. I, I do wonder, why do we only get four points? Hmm. Yeah, fishing hobby. That's going to come in uh, useful once we can, we can cook meals and we can actually fish. First, we want more wood, though. I think you're going to have to rest a little bit. You're going to get wood. Um, let, let's see, actually, because I think you need scavenge uh, for that. Yeah, our second best is, uh, of course, your... Well, our very best is Yuri. Let's see, scavenging, scavenging. 40, 35. Alice is pretty good at it, but I want to I wanna really preserve her for exploration. You know what, we'll, we'll just send Alejandro there, that's fine. We don't really need the fishing rod uh, just now. Let's give you some constitution. It'll um, make stuff less exhaustive and it'll make it uh, easier for her to recover from fatigue. Mm, everyone's doing their job. Alright, even Bob, he's lying down. Uh, you're pretty tired, let's uh, put you down for a little bit as well. And you as well, I think. And, you know, you know, you can take a nap. That's fine. We're getting one wood, one rope, one meal, and a barely edible meal. But we've got a scientific magazine. We might be able to give that to Ilyana. Um, make research go a bit smoother. Fatigue is decreasing. That's good. That's that's actually why we did it. But fine. We're level two with Alejandro. We'll uh, level him up next day. First, though, we're going to have to feed our people, and we're going to read some dialogue, because every day there's an event, of course. It's been a week since, you know, yeah, between you and me, if you had asked me whether we would survive one week after the day we crashed, I'm not sure what I would have answered. Why the long faces? That's good news, no? We should celebrate. Maybe cook some sort of cake. Happiness does not depend... Oh, no. I, I can try the Russian accent, I guess. Happiness does not depend on outward things, but on the way we see them. Yes, let's have a cake, and maybe we can offer each other presents too, stupid little girl. It's a miracle you survive with this level of carelessness. Stop it, Jacob. You can think what you want, but have some respect for the child. That sounds like a Romanian, my god. Stop considering me as a child. I can take care of my own, too. I think keeping our morale up is as important as finding food. You don't know that the first cause of death for lost people is suicide? I guess she's Russian, too. Although she seems like a clever girl, so she might know English a bit better. Okay, let's calm down. Hold your tits, everyone. Uh, we're all a bit tensed. Let's sleep it over and continue the best we can. All right. Seems like a, a healthy attitude. Let's uh, give our people some food. That's what they desire. That's what they need. Thing is, we are running out of supply, which kind of sucks because that means that everyone's probably going to be a bit hung hungry uh, the following days, the coming days. Uh, sorry. Yeah, that kind of sucks. But yeah, that's day eight. We made a good progress there. We did three days, I believe. So I'll see you guys next time. Um, I hope to see you guys around. Make sure to let me know what you think in the comments down below. And uh, as always, have a good one. Cheers.